Yo, what's up YouTube? It is OG and today we are back with another Power League video. So just wanted to update you guys, we're currently 10th in the world and definitely, I mean we were at 2 like a few days ago. So you know, I want to get back up there. But uh, I had some good games today so I figured I'd record them. I had a really crazy Mandy one that I'm going to show you guys uh, coming up soon so make sure you guys are around for that. But uh, yeah, the season's coming to an end soon, so definitely want to get a video of me getting number one at some point. Don't want to drink soup, but I think I can do it. I just gotta get like one really good day. But uh, yeah, let's get into today's games. Alright guys, so you can see this draft is pretty weird. Uh, I think my team first picked Brock, which made it really hard. Um, <clears throat> definitely not a good first pick. And then they went Mr. P, which I'm not the biggest... I, I love Mr. P, I just don't think it's really the best in uh, Knockout. And so I just went Mandy to try to carry the game. And uh, yeah, so we're going to be on the Mandy. And you know, it's pretty boring at the start in Knockout. Um, nothing really happens. You're just poking, trying to build up super. And the Brock almost gets caught out there. I'm going to have to body block for him. I think he goes down if I don't body block for him. And I could have maybe done a slow there on the Nani. I do have the slow gadget on. Uh, usually I go the shoot through wall, but because there's a Shelly, I kind of wanted to slow it. And uh, you'll see a really nice play with the slow gadget coming up in the next round. But uh, yeah, like I said, <laughs> our comp's not the best. Um, when we get porters though, I think it is pretty good. And it's not really a good gene game, but uh, gene will just be useful no matter what. Like it's kit so good with the poke and then uh, you know, the pull obviously is really good too, and just the healing all the time is really nice to have. That's why it's such a high priority pick in Knockout especially. Uh, so we're gonna get Shelly supered and just push back against our wall. I think we almost go down here, and uh, yeah, you can see the Gene gadget come down. I am, I don't want to give the Gene the pull, so I'm fine dying to the Nani over, like, all their supers are pretty good, but uh, yeah, I know like, this is pretty hard to win, so I'm going to go over here and just make an insane play. This is one of my best Mandy plays of all time. So I'm going to slow him and line it up with the Gene, and then I know they're all running away, and I just team whip. <laughs> so that's why I went Mandy, so I could do something like that. Uh, obviously not to that extent, but uh, you know it turned out pretty good. And uh, yeah, that's a very nice Mandy play for myself, you know. I do like Mandy a lot, and uh, pretty bad slow gadget for me there. Uh, I think I was just feeling myself a little too much. I wanted to <laughs> just slow and then, um, you know, go for a super. But I'm going to block the Nani head, and it's important that I caught it early. Otherwise, they can knock us within range. The Gene can, like, uh, use its uh, gadget as well, or just finish us off pretty easily. So I am going to miss my slow, and I'll get the Gene pretty low, which is really good for us. Um... But nothing really happens from it. And the Shelly is going super aggro here. He gets our Porter, so we should be able to get him here. But uh, yeah, he just gets away. Shelly is very fast. Oh, and the Gene lives on 18 HP. It's really unfortunate for us as well. Um, and I do have my Super, so I think I'm going to go for the Gene. Or maybe I hold it, but uh, yeah, I end up missing my Super. So we're pretty backed up. My Super was kind of the last chance of us winning the round, I think. And uh, yeah, the Band-Aid on the Shelly is going to heal it up, and they are going to win the first round. But uh, yeah, we're going to watch the second one, because I think I do pretty good in the second one too. Um, Alright guys, so we did lose the first round, but uh, we managed to win the second one, so we're going to be going over the third round really fast as well. And uh, I think it was really good gameplay as well, so... Yeah, uh, we did manage to win it. The Nani wasted all his gadgets, and I think that's how we kind of caught up and managed to win that second round. So we're just going to check the bush for the Shelly. Like, people lose a lot of games by not checking the bush, so I think it's fine. Like, not a lot really happens in the first, like, 10 to 15 seconds of knockout, so it's always better to be safe than sorry, I think. And if you see all three of them, obviously you don't have to, but, uh, yeah, just better to be on the safe side with these kind of things. And I'm going to see if I can get a slow off on them. I'm kind of waiting, and I'll hit the Gene. And unfortunately, the Shelly is going to come and just kill me. Mr. P did go down, but I think that's fine. Like, uh, obviously, it's not ideal. If I didn't have my Super there, I could go for another crazy play. But, uh, yeah, unfortunately, I didn't. And, uh, you know, we have to win this one. Otherwise, we do lose the match. 
so I'm one shot to my super, which is really nice, and uh, I can't one shot any of them, but you want to ideally slow someone and then um, use your super on them, or catch them. There's a lot of corridors on this map, and <clears throat> I think if you catch them in those, it's really good. So they are going to see with my gadget on, it's kind of a mistake for me. Uh, don't want to pop your gadget too early if you don't have to, but I do have my super now, so I can definitely just go for that like slow and then super, or if I hit someone, you know, it doesn't have to be a slow. Slow just makes it like almost like a guaranteed kill. So I see the gene and I'm kind of lining him up and I think I see someone take some damage and yeah, I'll get a good super off on the Nani and he didn't return to center it, so we got a lot of position off that and he is going to use one of his gadgets there as well. So Mandy Super is really good, you can uh, kind of like just chain them if you are, uh, you know, hitting them. You can chain them pretty fast, it's like three hits after you hit one, so I don't know what he's doing there, but he is... <laughs> It's kind of silly watching that back. I don't, I don't really know what he's going for, but I am gonna get my super back as well, which is really nice. And uh, yeah, so I think the positioning you get if you hit someone, and the Nani didn't like have the reflexes to return to center it, so I think it kind of won us that round as well. Uh, so I do have one slow, and I definitely should have gone for a slow on killer there, like watching it back. I get two shots on him, and then I can kill him, but I will hit the gene, and I think I get him, yeah. So I'm going to get the gene, and, uh, you know, that is the main threat. As long as the Nani doesn't have head, Shelly doesn't have super, so we just gotta, like, it's our game to lose now, kinda. So we're just gonna hang back and, uh, just kinda play it very slow. There's no need to rush. The Brock's gonna break the grass, which is good play. It just, uh, kinda takes out some of the risk. Now, I wasn't sure if the Shelly was still up there, but he was, and, uh, gotta be careful. Clay Pigeon does so much damage, and, uh, yeah, we're gonna get the last shot there and just finish him off. Alright guys, so this is probably my craziest game of the day. You can just see the comp, and uh, we're against iChaos and uh, some other really good EU players. I think Angel Boy was on the team as well, who's on Navi. Um, and on my team I have Zeta, Meow, and uh, the Meg. But uh, yeah, our draft is terrible, and I'm on like 120 ping or whatever, and I don't know how we won a game. This is the third game, so it's 1-1 right now. But look how bad our comp is. Like, we don't have a mid. Uh, he last picked M's for some reason. I don't know why. He likes M's, but... Uh, yeah, we don't have a mid, so it's like the Shelly and me trying to play mid, but... I'm just trying to get my penguins, and I think he got some good, like, damage on the turret. Yeah, and the turret is using the vision, so, uh... Doesn't have the pets, which I think is kind of interesting. I probably did it for M's. So as long as they don't get snuck up on, I think it's fine. And I am building up towards those pets. Tara does have pull. And really good Shelly super there. Like, I wasn't expecting the Tara to run at me, but the Shelly definitely saved my life. So uh, really heads up play from the Meg there. And uh, yeah, you can see I'm slowly getting towards the penguins. And that is when this map starts to become a lot easier because it's like you permanently have something scouting out where they are. This map is so much bushes, right? So, uh, yeah, my M's is gonna go down. It's not really the end of the world. It got Tara super. You can't really do anything. Like, it's better than someone with the gems dying, I guess. Um, so, yeah, this is not looking too good for us. Like, the comp is just better in every way, but I guess we have a Shelly. <laughs> and, uh, we have the penguins. So, we're gonna pinch out Tara there. And we need to get mid control, so yeah, we're slowly working towards that. But uh, I am gonna get taken out here, which kind of sucks. Uh, I think the dog got a good shot off, and I thought we were gonna lose the game here. And then the Shelly has like a crazy like gadget or something like that, and he just like kind of backs them all up and uh, gets like I Chaos really low. He's the Janet, and uh, yeah, Angel Boy is the Tara, I Chaos is the Janet. I'm not sure about the dog. But uh, then you can see how good vision gear is. It's gonna show where the turret is. And I'm gonna put my penguins there just because I see he's getting bounced on. And we gotta keep the Shelly alive, that's our carry. So penguins are gonna tank for our boy right there, the Meg. And uh, yeah, Ikeas is gonna get that gem and fly out. He'll get a hit on me, but uh, yeah. My team is just playing very nuts right now, honestly. Like I'm just kind of like a penguin slave, but the Shelly played out of his mind and our comp is so bad, like once again, like, and, you know, I don't want to make excuses, but playing on like 140 ping or something like that, whatever it is, like 130 ping, it's pretty difficult sometimes, especially when you're playing against someone like as good as like I Chaos and Angel Boy. Um, so, that was kind of like a crazy one. I was just like, as soon as we finished that draft, I'm like, okay, we lost this game.
Alright guys, and we are going to finish the video off with a fun Leon game against Zulan. So, a really good player. He's on Tribe. He's been like my opponent for like three years now. And uh, yeah, he's very good. So, he's going to be on the Grom and I'm on the Kitty Cat Leon. I use all the cat skins in the game, guys. Highly recommend. Cat B and Cat Leon. 10 out of 10. Uh, so, I'm going to be on the Bell Lane, which is pretty hard lane. So, I don't think like Leon's like... I mean, it's definitely hard, you just gotta be careful of the traps, and, uh, you know, he should be pushing me back, but I'm kinda getting some position, and I think that makes it pretty hard on Zulin as well. And really nice shot from McBoy over there as well, he's doing a great job on his side. So I went Leon just because they have a Grom, and uh, we have a Gus, and Grom cannot do anything to a brawler that gets on top of him. So, uh, yeah, I'm gonna go all the way across. I know there's bell traps, and I'm just gonna go for the Grom, and uh, I'll get out pretty easily. So, it's like as simple as that, obviously. You have to be sneaky about when you use your invis and stuff like that. So, I'm gonna use my turret to block the bell shot and just stay alive, and I will get him with some fadeaway shots. So, uh, yeah, pretty good pinch there from my Sprout as well. And you can see Zulin just going to work on the Grom there. Really nice kill from him so the combo with grom when you have your super is it's kind of similar to gus where if you knock them back you'll get a free hit and uh on grom that's like at least like 4k damage so you can kill like pretty much anyone like under 4k hp like almost every time and zoo is just gonna get another really good kill so he's kind of like so i'm just waiting the bush here to like scare them so the e is panicking he thinks i'm around and I know like I have to stay alive here, so I'm just kind of waiting and uh, it doesn't matter if my teammates die as much. I'm looking for my opportunity and uh, I could have went for Zoo, but it's a good thing I didn't because uh, there is a trap over there. I probably would have hit it and I could have died. And we're only up by two stars at this point here, so it's super close here. Um, so yeah, got to be really careful and luckily McBoy gets a good kill and uh, yeah, we are going to win that game 21 to 14. Anyways guys, I hope you guys are enjoying the more consistent uploads with the Power League video videos. If you guys do like them, just let me know below and uh, I'll keep more coming for you. Thanks. Peace.